Now, if we're showing that two lines or two or more lines are either perpendicular or parallel, it's all about the gradient. That's what we're interested in. So, what we can do, we can write different equations that have y equals mx plus c, it looks like a 2, plus c, or ax plus by equals c. And what the idea is that we'd write um, these equations. So we'd write 1 in that form, 1 in that form, and we just keep going. And we just say, okay, which ones are um, parallel? Which ones are perpendicular? So we may have 5 of them. may have 5 and 5, and we just say, which ones are parallel? Which ones are perpendicular? As well as that, you can scaffold and say, to, and, and ask the person to write them in y equals mx plus c. And then based on that, then they can determine that. The other option is that you can step things up a little bit and start with uh, a line and start with two points. And we say, there's an equation, we'll find the equation of that line. Here is another line, find the equation there, show that they are perpendicular or not perpendicular or parallel or whatever the case may be. That's the other thing you can do.